Okay, folks. You know, that was a, a tough, hardcore point. Good evening. Yes, uh, we know they are very well, very well competitive team and also organized. And uh, we need break uh, on the match, on the 90 minute things tactically, but isn't uh, enough today for for win. But uh, for us, after when we we draw. Uh, we continue in taking risk because we we wanted to win, but also considered some chances for for them. And then we finish is uh, not happy with uh, this point, but also recognize it, uh, their work. What did you say to the team at half time? Did you think you get the second half response from them all the time? We spoke. This team is is very difficult to break, uh, uh, finding goal or to break uh, the, their lines defensively, and their transition is very good transition. And uh, we didn't want to to say one goal because also it's more difficult, but. Uh, our idea changed a little because uh, we spoke in the dressing room in the half time. We need we need uh, to to take more risk on the on the match. But the risk is thinking to win. But also uh, we need good balance in the in the transition against one team very very with very good co transition and above all when. When he's in his Traore uh, the last minute on the on the game, but I think the team uh, they they played with with character and uh, we had chances to to draw before and also continuing for for creative and and, and uh, looking forward to 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 win this match and then we, when we draw. The last uh, five or uh, ten minutes is the same idea, and with the with the risk, but also thinking to win. And when finish it, we can say, okay, is for shooting. I think we we deserve it both. We need, uh, and, and we 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 know, or we knew today. We need uh, the goalkeeper also with. Uh, his performance because uh, and above all when when uh, we are uh, having having risk in, in our attacking moment for for uh, give then transition and an op option in in the in, in the transition moment and we need the goalkeeper and uh, I think uh, today also the, his performance is, is is a good for us. Is tactically is one changement thinking uh, do with the with rights and and left back more more deep and doing inside more possession for go then for with with Sea that with with Hector. We we did sometimes good this situation and uh, and we created chances also for for scored but uh, I think. Uh, uh, they work also is is good defensively because uh, they they block less less block is is, is also very hard. How do you think about Jaka's performance today? He sometimes he he seems very inconsistent. You know, when when he's good, he's really good. When he's not good, he almost costs the game. How do you think about him? He, he has uh, a big commitment with us and and, and also character and and. And his performance with his qualities is good for us. Uh, we need everybody, and uh, also, also for me and for the team, uh, to take more consistency. But it won't work in, in our way. But uh, I think the best important is, uh, in this way, be be with the with the uh, with the confidence, with 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 the this consistency, uh, creating uh, little by little, and, and with uh, with a. Uh, very big work, and I think uh, we are doing it. We are doing 
and uh, Shaka is doing also. Does it worry you that you're, you're, you're struggling to play in the first half as well as you're playing in the second half? Te preocupa que el Arsenal no juega a ritmo alto en la primera parte, pero luego ¿Quién? va a hacerlo mucho mejor el Arsenal. Ah. But the, the, the rhythm also is uh, because, for example, uh, when you are playing in the 90 minutes, the two teams is starting with uh, more intensity the, the, the game, and uh, you need, little by little, in the 90 minutes, uh, imposing your your uh, or your your game your your job or your individual equality or your individual also physically how you are but in the first half i think uh, they are also very very hard and it's not easy in the duel individually to 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 do against against them but uh, is is maybe one thing we can improve but uh, with uh, being natural in in in, in our work when you're chasing a game with 15 minutes to go, what is the thinking behind taking off Meza Erzo? And also, what's the latest on Danny Welbeck's situation? When you had to remount the game, why did you decide to take off a Meza Erzo? And then, you asked me how is Danny Welbeck, how is the situation? I decided to... to we, we have two players in the... We had two players in the, in, in the bench, like uh, Mkhitaryan, like uh, Aaron Lansky, also attacking player. A midfielder, with, but uh, uh, attacking midfielder, and I decided for for this reason. And then Danny Wolbeck, uh, is well, his injury is big injury, and uh, we spoke with him yesterday and today, and uh, uh, with the calm and also support him uh, with uh, our our also our personal relationship between the player and between uh, the staff, and and then. Uh, I, I, I think he is going to, to come uh, with us, uh, uh, I think, in, in not a lot of time. He's in a break. He's in a broken ankle. Yeah, yeah he, he, he did the operation uh, uh, Friday. You don't, you don't know? No? no, no. no? I think it's better the doctor say to you. It's big injury in the ankle, but it's maybe it's, it's you don't know. Is the doctor can say better than me? Thank you. Thanks, everyone.